Okay, I should be live. Hi, it's me, your Mother Goose Justine, and I am back with a very cozy evening stream. I'd love to welcome my gaggle back to my flock. No reactions today. I'm actually going to be doing a uh, cozy tarot stream because we've had a serious, serious leak in the Amberverse. Hey, Mary Cab. Hey, Sherry. Serious leak. Um, if you guys are not familiar with the leak and the screenshots that were leaked, I highly encourage you. I, I, oh, by the way, I'm going to have a timestamp to when the uh, tarot reaction begins. If you're not, oh yeah, my cap. Sorry, God. I washed my hair not long, long ago. And um, yeah, I was obviously not expecting to do this tonight. Uh, I was obviously not expected expecting to do this tonight but i i know i'm not gonna be able to sleep yes facebook groups veronica that's how i found out about this tea <laughs> jay just jumped over from starge luck um yeah selena said okay oh my god okay let's start at the beginning so there were screenshots uh Becky texting some or messaging someone on Facebook Messenger, uh, spilling serious tea about Amber. Um, <laughs> you guys are laughing at my cap. Um, yeah, spilling serious tea about Amber. Now, um, yes, yeah, so a surprise late in our card card late night card reading. So I saw the screenshots and at first. I wrote them off. I was like, look, I, I, I don't, I, I didn't buy them. Right. Or no, it's not that I didn't, I didn't believe that they were true. Me, she were going to get to that. It's not that I didn't believe that they were true. It's just, I had seen, I had seen on my Facebook groups, a screen recording proving that the messages were real. Yes, Anfordite predicted this, Megan. Like, epic. So, I've seen, and if you guys haven't seen it, I encourage you, I put it in my description box because I go on Twitter because I was like, you know what? I know somebody on Twitter, someone has a shareable link of this video proving that these messages are real. That I know Amber and Becky are now trying to say are fake. It's not true. There's a screen, somebody screen recorded proving that the messages are from Becky. And it's out there. Jamie's here. <laughs> hey, Ms. Magpie. So anyway, so I came through with that receipt. It's in the description box. Thanks, Michael B. Petty. Seriously, he came through with a shareable link for you guys. If you want to go, click on it. Um, if... Okay, right, Selena. She called Becky during the stream. I heard about this. I'm reacting to it tomorrow at 11 a.m. She called Becky to prove that it's that it's fake, and Becky confirmed it's fake. But we have the screen recording. We know they're real. The, the screen recording is down below. Click it. It's in my description. Thank you for the super chat, maybe. Maybe he's drawing some oracle cards for this. Um, yeah. So... Anyway, so if you guys aren't familiar with this, right, okay, Danny, Amber is saying these screenshots are fake, but we know they're not because click the link that's in my description. Just click the link. We, like, they're, they're not fake. Wait, Heather said, can you just show them to us all? What do you mean? The screenshots? It, you can click the link and pause. You can read them. I, I don't know how... <laughs> Jazzberry says, what screenshots? Click the link in my description. It's called Proof Screenshots Are Real. Click the link. It's right there, if you guys don't know what I'm talking about. And my moderators, I do ask, as I get started on the reading, if people are asking, wait, what screenshots? What are you talking about? Tell them to click the link. I don't have an easier... I don't, I don't have a link to the actual screenshot, so it's easier to read, but you're going to have to watch the video on pause. So, yeah. Yeah, it's not fake. It's, this is real. Yeah, Michael B. Petty came through, Jamie, because I don't know how to link to Facebook. I don't know if I can. I don't want to get kicked out of the group. So, I was like, there's got to be a link to this somewhere. <laughs> and Michael B. Petty came through. 
So anyway, I got all this tea on a Facebook group. So um, I can't. <laughs> uh, yeah, click the link, Kimberlyn. It's, it's short. It's short just so you guys can catch up. If you don't know what I'm talking about, but I feel like everybody's talking about it. I'm freaking um. Oh, Kiwi Farms has this, I'm sure, Fablo Escobar. I'm sure Kiwi, Kiwi Farms has this. So the only thing... Yeah, no, nah, I'm not, I'm not going to link to the Facebook group, but I do have a link to Michael B. Petty's tweet because he posted the video, so I just... Yeah. You think that video is sus, DD? I don't think so. Look at the time. Look at the, look at the battery, like nothing changes. In the beginning it does because there's an obvious jump cut in the beginning, which the person who posted it explains that, but it's, yeah. Yeah, so anyway, so if anybody new comes in and they have no idea what we're talking about, I do ask my moderators to tell them to click the link in my description so they can watch the video so you guys can get caught up because I need my flock to be caught up because we're about to be reading and I'm going and I'm reacting tomorrow. I'm sure I'll be referencing these, these messages constantly. So, all right. I, I do want to say Fablo Escobar that I've only seen proof and receipts of the Facebook messages. Everything that was in everything, like there was another, thing that was like a paragraph that someone typed that like the person typed a paragraph summarizing everything that um right that's what I'm getting at Rebecca everything in the typed summary I'm not I'm not taking that as gold but the um but the Facebook messages are real and if that's true then we know that Becky is not really quarantining she's just gone <laughs> And yeah. So anyway, what I wanted to do, I wanted to do a relationship reading for Amberlynn and Becky to see what's going on with them. Yeah, the, the paragraph typed out, that I'm not entirely buying. I, you guys probably don't know what I'm talking about, but there was another part, there was a paragraph they typed summarizing other things that Becky has said. And I don't know if I buy all that because I need receipts for that. But, oh, we don't know who, we don't know who that person is, Brooklyn. And I, I feel like that should have been, um, oh, geez, hold on. Sorry, my, anyway. I was getting a call. <laughs> anyway, guys, yeah, the pa there's a paragraph. Um, the paragraph is out there, but I need receipts for the other stuff in the paragraph. So I want to look into what's going on with Amberlynn and Becky at this point. Let's see, because I'm also wondering, wait, was this all just like a... Look, is this all like... They, look, they needed... Oh, the paragraph is posted on Twitter. Okay, I'm not really on Twitter too often. So the paragraph is out there. I'm not, I'm not entirely sold on the paragraph at all, but yeah, the Facebook messages are legit. Absolutely. Jamie, I agree. So what's going on with those two? So let's look at them first. Uh, shoebox, if you don't know what's going on with the tea, I encourage you to click the link in my description. There's screenshots that late that leaked, and you can pause to read the screenshots. All right, so I want to see what's... Sorry, I'm just texting... Uh... I'm texting my friend. Okay. Guys. Yeah, the tea is scalding, Jay. Oh, my God. Okay. So.
Thank you so much, Karina. Karina said, why isn't Jesse... Wait, who's Jesse? I don't know, but hi. <laughs> Okay, so I want to see what's going on with Amber and Becky right now. Amber, King of Cups. Amber's in control of her emotions. She's showing up as the King of Cups. Becky is... <sighs> Becky is four pen pentacles. She is hanging in there. Uh... Becky could be rehoming, but Amber seems very satisfied right now. What's that about? Amber's in a good mood because she's moving on. She's moving on. She She's moving on. <laughs> Yeah, she holds... Right, Mika. Right. Right, the DMs are the only proven thing right now, guys. If you guys are lo looking for the link, it's in my description box. Um, yeah, be probably because of wifey, um, Danny. Becky. Oh, Yeah, Becky is definitely rehomed, in my opinion. I think Becky... You can see the DMs in the uh, in the video. Um, you have to pause. I don't have better links to the actual DMs. But you have to pause in the video to read them. Thank you. This is a silk cap to help my curls. This is, this is what I do after I shower and <laughs> get my hair deep conditioned. Anyway, so... Becky, in my opinion, is rehomed. Amber is very satisfied. She's probably getting a lot of fuel right now, a lot of attention. She's showing up as the King of Cups. She's in control of her emotions. She's not pissed. She's not raging. She was raging, raging hard, Fat Blue Escobar. Maybe she was in the stream, but she. it seems like she's in her bliss right now a little bit. Like, this is... I mean, whatever's happening right now, I think Amber is happy it's happening, believe it or not. Okay, so that's these two right now. Okay. Um, m moving forward, by moving forward, I mean like tomorrow, right? I, I think, I think tomorrow the both of them are going to be like, oh crap. <laughs> I think, Christopher, you think they're going to stay together? It's funny because for like, hey Jimbo. What, who's going to stay together? Amberlynn and Becky? Um, you know, I wouldn't be surprised if as of tomorrow, even their friendship is over. I had to say, two cups reversed. Becky got the ten of cups reversed. I think even their friendship's over. Thank you, Kimberlini, for sharing the link. Uh, okay, moving forward, forward. Um, it's moving forward. For, okay, so I'm thinking, so this is my thinking as I'm pulling cards, right? 
Um, so this is as of right, as of right now, Amberlynn's kind of satisfied, right? Like she got a lot of attention. Her video is getting a lot of clicks. She's in control of her emotions. Um, and she's moving on. She feels it. like she's emotionally, like she's over it. She's done, right? Eight of cups. She's done. Uh, Becky, on the other hand, is kind of, um, she's, she's rehomed. She's got two home cards. She's got the four pentacles and she also has the tower. So she is rehomed. Um, moving forward, and of course I'm thinking like tomorrow, um, I think their friendship is over. And I thought moving forward the next week or so, um, it's interesting because they both got tens. Amberlynn got the Ten of Swords. Becky got the Wheel of Fortune, which is 10 in the Major Arcana. So, more this is over cards. <laughs> this is over, over, over. The screenshots are hot tea, Troubled Waters. The screenshots are very hot tea. Very hot tea. This friendship is over, I'm telling you. If it's... Done. Bye. It, it's done. I think, um, I think moving forward, I think Amberlynn is going to be realizing how effed she is. Look at, look at that cat. That cat is in a very vicarious, like, look, the, the, <laughs> this, this, Um, this, this cat is just, is in, is in quite a quandary. Like, this is it. Like, this, <laughs> this, this is it. This is the darkest before dawn. Um, I think Amber is going to be realizing in the next week just how apt she really is. Um... Yeah, and Becky got the Wheel of Fortune. So I think things are going to be changing for her in the next week or so. Who leaked the messages? What's her name? From what I understand, and, you know, maybe Jamie can help me here, but from what I understand, somebody from one of the Facebook groups I'm in befriended Becky while she was selling things on Facebook Marketplace, and she's been spilling tea or Becky's been spilling tea to this person. If, if I have that correct, I think that's where this came from. I mean, if that video that I posted in my, uh, in, in my description box is faked, that is quite a deep fake. That's like CGI good because, um, you think there's going to be more tea, Terry? I don't know. I don't know. All right, what, what else is happening with Becky? Oh my God, Amberlynn got another 10. Holy bolly, 10 of Pentacles. Wow, I think Ten of Pentacles reversed. Um, I wouldn't be surprised if in the next week or so, Amberlynn finds that things with, with even Wifey aren't working out either. Ten of Pentacles reversed. Ten of Pentacles is kind of like a home family card. If, again, if you guys aren't sure about the screenshots or what, what I'm talking about, click the link in my uh, description box. Yeah, the cards are intense. It, I feel like this is going to be a big week, whatever it is. We, we can call this boom week. 
Moving forward, uh, also, to go with the Wheel of Fortune, Becky has the Five of Wands. So I also kind of see this as like a creativity card. I feel like this is going to be a lot of... I, I feel like Becky's going to be having to deal with not only like a lot of things that she has to do, but like also a lot of people and all their opinions. I feel like, oh, absolutely, Mama Bear. Tower and Wheel of Fortune, everything changing for the better, for sure. But it's going to be weird for Becky. She's going to have to hear it from a lot of people, and that's going to be frustrating. That That's probably going to be frustrating for her. I think she's going to be hearing it from a lot of people. I, I feel like a good outlet for her is to be more creative, um, to spend time paying attention. I know she's been getting uh, requests for commissions and stuff. If I had advice for Amber, the five of wands can be difficult, but like, it's also, it's, it's like, it's asking for creativity, right? So if I were Becky's friend, I would say that she wants to be, she probably wants to be like a little bit more creative in the coming week. That, that might help her because I think she's going to be having to deal with a lot of things and hearing it from a lot of people and having a lot of ideas and it's going to be a lot of movement. Full moon coming up August 22nd. Oh gosh, iridescent guck. Yeah, full moon. That's We sure got some things coming to fruition here, guys. I got two tens. No, three tens <laughs> in this reading alone. And I only pulled one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten cards. Three out of ten are tens. That is, and one of them is the tower. So, but I feel like it's, I, do, I just, I mean, yes, it is change for the better, but it is going to be change for Becky. Yeah, I feel a little bad for Amberlynn 2, Blue 2, reading those. That's that's rough. We basically learned in those screenshots that Amber does indeed have a lot of trouble taking care of herself. And, um, you know, and, and, it's, and it's hard. We also know that I was right about Becky not actually quarantining right now. Queen Trina Corn said, August 22nd, full moons in Jupiter. Uh, Jupiter rules Sagittarius. Maybe Becky will drop more tea. Well, wait, what do you mean by full moons, full moon in Jupiter? Jupiter rules Sagittarius. Is the full moon in Sagittarius? My, my ascendant is Sagittarius. Which, by the way, by the way, fun fact about me, if there's any astrology nerds here, um, yeah, my ascendant, it, my rising sign is Sagittarius. Tell me how Neptune is like conjunct my ascendant. And also Neptune is directly opposite my son in the seventh house, like direct to the degree, almost to the minutes of a degree. It's directly opposite my son. So I feel like I don't know what that means. I, I looked it up and apparently that makes me like, I don't know, I could be like a thief easily or like, or a drug addict, but I'm, I'm not really any of those things. So I'm not sure, <laughs> but <laughs> it's a fun fact that I was just looking at my natal chart and literally to the degree, to the degree, Neptune directly across from my son in cancer. It's nuts. Nuts. <laughs> Anyway, any astrology nerds can help me with that? Probably not. I don't know. Anyway, so do I dare look at the rest of the month? A month from now? What's today? The 19th? Do we want to look at uh, September 19th? What's going on with Amber? Oh, no. Oh, no. I got to clarify that. Roman numerals. <laughs> Five, six, seven,
Oh gosh. Um, I'm not happy about the cards I pulled for Amber at all. And, um, oh, God bless her. I don't know what to say. I'm not happy about, I don't even know if I want to share them. Okay, so wait, Strawberry Cosmo said, I think it can make you a person that does a lot of daydreaming and has a good imagination. Yeah, that I do do a ton of daydreaming. You know, one of my favorite things to do is I, and maybe this is, because I, I heard that, you know, um, Neptun, um, Neptunian people, which I guess I would be, they have escapist tendencies, and I don't, I, I, never, I never got too big into drugs or anything like that. Even like when I was taking my, medicine i um i don't know you guys know i like stopped doing it and you know because i'm not into but i will escape and do nothing but listen to music for hours and just imagine things that's something wait you guys want me to share oh gosh all right so for the next couple um so for the month i got um the uh, Eight of Pentacles, well, first of all, I got the Death card. And I clarified that with the Eight of Pentacles reversed. And um, so if I could, what I'm thinking, I mean, that could mean a lot of different things. But, um, oh, thank you so much, Kumquat. Treat Mert to a coffee. I didn't, thank you so much. Um, I would guess that she's um, she's given up and she's not making YouTube videos anymore. That's what I would guess. I mean. The death card can mean a lot of different things. It could even be a positive thing. Um, that's why I wanted to clarify. But to clarify that with the Eight of Pentacles reversed, I mean, the Eight of Pentacles, well dignified, is like you're diligently working on something for a benefit. and But so I think she's going to... Oh, gosh. God bless her. God bless her. God bless her. Oh, God bless her. I'm getting, like, teary-eyed. Oh, Jamie asked what else could she do for money, though. I hope it's true that she has a bunch of money saved. Um, Data Pentacles would, would indicate that, but it is, um... Ah, Ann Stan said mal maladaptive day daydreaming. Yeah, that probably sounds like me. Um, what's going on with Becky moving forward? Oh, two of Pentacles, and we got the, or no, not the, the Two of Wands. You guys wouldn't believe that, okay, so let's, you know, let we're shifting now to Becky. And, um. We got the Nine of Pentacles. Well, first of all, I got the Two of Wands. So this is um, Two of This is she has a vision for her future. She is she has a vision for the future. I clarified that with the Nine of Pentacles. Both of them upright. She is um, yeah Two of Wands for Becky. Clarified by the Nine of Pentacles. So she has a vision for the future because she's been doing well for herself. So she's able to like start making plans for herself and she's starting to have the means to um she's starting to have the means to do that and it's just it's just wonderful it's just wonderful i can't say the same for amber in a month from now um i do think it's possible that uh 
Amber did go live, Kimberlini, and I, I, um, she did go live. She denied the screenshots. She called Becky to confirm that they were fake. Becky said that they were fake, but like I said, I've got the screenshot. Thank you so much, Megan. <laughs> I'm late. I was bathing my baby. What did I miss? Well, we just did a little tarot spread for Amber and Becky, um, regarding the tea that was spilled today. If you're not familiar with the tea, click the link that I posted in my description box. Um, anyway, so I think this is going to be a tough month for Amber. This is going to be a tough month. Anyway, I don't know what else to say. Amber was live just for an hour, Ellie. Well, I'll be reacting to it uh, tomorrow. Um, this is another reading I really hope is wrong. <laughs> I really hope this reading is wrong. I mean, for Amber's sake, I hope it's correct for Becky because I feel like this this change of home and all of it is is for the best, and I feel like she's going to be doing very well for herself, and um, I'm very happy for her. I just have a feeling, you know, I don't even know if I want to talk about Amber's side at all. I just... It has been a wild ride in the Amberverse iridescent guck. Definitely wild. Oh, thank you so much, Megan. All right, you have homework. Better get it done. I'm pretty much done here anyway. I just wanted to do a reading for Amberlynn and Becky um, real fast. Real fast. I'm gonna put these away. It does get worse and worse, Jimbo. It just I don't know, it's I just really wish the best for everybody. I really do, you know, I just Y'all are going to think I'm nuts, but I'm like seriously going to pray for Amber tonight because I don't know because <laughs> I, because I am because I, I don't know. I, I know that Amber's, I know. I just, you guys know, I mean, I feel like this is going to be a, a hard month for her and I feel like. She's had opportunity after after opportunity. Okay, Jimbo said um, it, for the screenshots, if you want a better picture of it, um, on Kiwi Farms, it's, it's in the general discussion thread under the Amberlynn Read Board for those who prefer that. Of course, Twinkie and the cats deserve better. Uh, <laughs> just seen in her bonnet praying for Amber. Don't make fun of me. <laughs> what am I seeing exactly for Amber Camberlini? I, I just have a feeling that what I'm seeing is, is I don't think, I think as of imminently, like in the next week even, or within the week, I feel like her and wifey will no longer be a thing. And I feel like by a month from now, she's not even going to be posting on YouTube because I feel like she would have given up on herself or just like, I, don't, I hope that's not right. I hope I'm wrong.
Stop it. The anybody said she seems annoyed with the animals last stream. Oh, God, that's so sad. The poor animals. Lucy says, you know, Amber is going to steal Becky's phone and check her Twitter DMs. How? Becky's not there. Amber doesn't drive. She can't take an Uber. Oh, gosh. I just... I just don't know, guys. I just... Yeah, there's more of the leak. Hey, Orko! I didn't even know she were in here. I was so... Um... There's more to that. I mean, there was more that came out, but it hasn't been verified, so... It has not been verified. So, I don't want to speak to that. The moon. <laughs> secrets. I feel like there's more secrets that we don't know yet. Right, yeah, Alex said, did you see on the farms they posted a video to verify? Right, I have a, um, Jimbo, thank you so much for posting the link to the Amber threat. Thank you so much. Um, yeah, I have a link to that video in my description. I've been referring to it this whole stream in case anybody's not caught up. Um, I'm going to be live streaming tomorrow at 11 a.m. I'm going to be live streaming tomorrow at 11 a.m. to react to Amber's stream tonight. Somebody asked, um, they said, so were those screenshots of Michael actually talking to Becky? No, that's, that's just, Michael just posted a video of the leaker proving that they were talking to Becky. Like that, that's all it is. If, the, if that's helpful. I hope this wasn't confusing. I wish I had better links for you guys, but I want to just have something to refer to. Oh, you don't have Twitter and you can't read the tweet. I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm live right now, Megan. I, oh my God. Why am I live? I think I'm about to get off though, because it's actually late for me. I am old and, uh, <laughs> yes. Prayers up for Twinkie star for sure. Um, a better link, if you can't do uh, Twitter, Jamie posted a link to a Kiwi Farms thread about it. Just scroll up a little bit in the chat and you'll see it. Thank you, Jimbo. Oh, wait, was it Jimbo that posted it? Yeah, Jimbo posted a link as well in the chat, so click it if, you're, if you still have no idea what I'm talking about. Oh, Mary Cat said, check out the video from It's Water Weight YouTube. They have it up. Thank you. Okay. I'll look for that. I'll put that in my description. Oh, thank you, Leslie. They said, have you lost more weight? Um, I, no, I haven't, actually. I've been the same dang weight for, like, over a year, I don't know. <laughs> I've been I've been around the same weight. It's making you sweaty, fat blow. I swear. I I had to go live. Thank you, Jimbo. That that's really nice of you, Jimbo. I have like amazing mods. I can't help it. It's low key exciting, Jen. Let me tell you what's exciting about it. It's because because of the possibilities. When one cycle ends, there's a possibility for something new and that's exciting right the what didn't work out fell away and now there's a possibility for something new and amberlynn has a possibility to actually you know to, to actually work on herself she has that possibility so karen i don't know if i want to read for twinkie i feel like that would i can't i i i, I can't Misha said the Amberverse is imploding. I need to stock up on popcorn and tea. I tell you what, I got some great cookies that I made the other day in, in the freezer. So I might enjoy some cookies and tea. <laughs> I can't, but I feel like this thing is like so serious. Like, 
uh, I feel like weird, like LOLing T about this, all this stuff, because I tell you what, it's serious stuff. If like, you can't even take care of yourself properly, you have dogs that you can't walk or take care of. Like, this is serious, heavy stuff, you know? Uh, you know, maybe it was silly. I went live with the bonnet, but guys, it's, um, I just deep conditioned my hair. So, you know, I have leave-in conditioner, oil, you know, it's marinating up there. I wasn't excited. I wasn't expecting to go live tonight. I just impulsively did it. <sighs> Melancholy said, did anyone bother watching Amber's most recent stream? You know, I feel the when I looked at it before, there were over 3,000 people watching. So I think she's doing pretty good. Yes, the water weight channel on YouTube apparently has the tea. Alright guys, I think I'm going to conclude this actually. I know this was a brief one, but I just wanted to do a reading. I will be, um, I will be back tomorrow at 11 a.m. Eastern. We're going to react to Amber's latest stream. I just wanted to do a quick reading. Corey said the Amberverse is finally getting exciting. Seriously, right? All right, guys. Well, if you haven't, please check out Starch Vlog, my other channel. I vlog. Um, I do what I eat in a day every day except Friday, pretty much. So check that out if you're interested in it. And I will be live tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. Eastern. So I hope to see you there. Bye, guys. Oh, sorry, guys. It's late for me. I'm old. Bye, guys. Good night.